We've made some great improvements to the comparison view in Denoise AI version 3.3, and I'm excited to show them to you now. So the first thing I'm gonna do is change my view by clicking on the view dropdown and selecting comparison view. Now the comparison view that you're used to gives you three quadrants with three different models, and then you've got your original always in the top left. And one of our most requested features is the ability to compare the same model using different settings. And that's something we built into the new comparison view. So the first thing I'll do is change my zoom here. I'll type in 300% to get a tighter view. Now between these three models, I like low light the best, but I wanna compare differing sharpness slider settings. And before the only option I had would be to change the slider settings in the lower left quadrant where low light is selected. But now I can have multiple quadrants displaying the low light model. So I've got my top right quadrant here. I know it's selected because it's highlighted in blue. I'm gonna go ahead and change the model to low light. And I'll do the same thing for this bottom right quadrant. I'll select it and select low light. And what I wanna do is again, see how the sharpness slider affects the image. So with this top right quadrant, I'm gonna disable the auto and then I'm gonna take the sharpness slider to zero. I'll leave this quadrant on auto and then I'll select the bottom right quadrant and again, disable it and bring the sharpness slider to 100. Now I can see the same model, but with different slider values. So I can really fine tune my selection. Another improvement to comparison view is that we've opened up the top left quadrant. So before you were only able to display the original version of your photo, which is very helpful. But let's say you want to compare either a fourth version of the low light model or just a different model altogether. Now you'll see this toggle over here that says original. When you disable it, you'll be able to assign a different model to that top left quadrant. So let's say I wanna compare severe noise to these three low light models. I'll go ahead and make sure that that quadrant is selected and then I'll click on severe noise. And now you have the ability to have four different quadrants completely customized to taste. If you wanna to return to your original view in that top left quadrant, just enable that toggle again. We hope you'll enjoy the improved comparison view and all of the other new features in Denoise AI. Thanks a lot.